Hey guys, hello everyone. Welcome to another Oriental Empires live stream. Today it's me, but if you can spot him, we have the surter right there. That's him. So we're both in the same room. Um, so yeah, today we're starting another Orient Empires multiplayer session. Um, we have quite a few people in the lobby, I'm just gonna mention them. So uh, we have Magayon as Vai, Vaka as Han, El Lobo as Zhao, my lovely intern King of Manners as Shang, uh, Cabbage as Yan, the Cert as Wu, because Wu would have thought, uh, Sanvon as Dogrong, uh, let's see. Hey, did you just... I think he just disappeared. Oh, now he's Ba. Sanvon is Ba. And Nevosi has Chu. So, um, yeah, pretty much we're starting another game. Uh, it's going to be a medium map and we're going to play the uh, on the Americas. Um, and I'm always playing as Ki or Chi because that's my favorite. Um, so I guess, is everyone's ready? Yeah, we're just going to hit start game. Although, is everyone ready? Not sure. Do we have too many people? Oh, Furi Kazan joined. Come on guys, pick your factions. This is taking too long. <laughs> Jumping from faction to faction, I guess that's why I can't start the game yet. Let's see. Hello Rasmus. Um, you're probably new to Oriental Empire as well. We're gonna show you the game today, so uh, I hope it's gonna look good for you. Um, these sessions are always quite fun. All the people in this chat are people that are in our Discord community. Uh, if you would like to join that community, the uh, invite link is in the title of this stream. So you can join us there and we do this every Friday, basically. Mm -hmm. Is this a racer jacket? It's a, it's a motocross inspired sweater, yes, that's correct. All right, come on guys, have you picked all your factions? One Sun Mirror joined now as well? God, I just I just announced everyone, but I think they're all still joining. Um, just please pick a faction. One Sun Mirror, this one's for you. Pick a faction, please. All right, I think we're ready. Yes, let's go. Fingers crossed for a good starting position. Um, so I think this is actually one of our bigger games because I can remember that this lovely little thingy over here, it used to be a lot smaller. So we have a full house. There we go. So always the lovely introduction window. Um, this can be very useful when you're playing this game because this lady can kind of tell you in what kind of area you are and some lovely tips and tricks for the early game. Um, but we don't need that right now. So I'm starting off here as Lindsay. Uh, last time I was the uh, Ice Queen of Iceberg Interactive uh, and I gave all my cities uh, these snowy, icy names. We could probably continue on that note but maybe try something different as well but we'll see later uh anyway so i have this really cool spot at the water i guess a lot of people will be situated somewhere near the water because we are playing americas so it's uh yeah it's gonna be interesting i'm very curious how this map is shaped uh, obviously we cannot see it yet because we have the fog of war um, but we're gonna start exploring a lot um, so, what do we have here? We start out with our leader, and I don't see any encounters close to me. That's mostly the place where I would send my leader to, to get those encounters and see if there's some nice early game bonuses. Um, for now, I'd say, if I am, yeah, so I'd say I'm somewhere, somewhere in the middle, maybe a little bit more, to, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit in the left, top left area, I'd say, yeah. So, hmm, I'd say I'm gonna go and explore down a little bit. So I'm gonna send my leader down, probably gonna send this settler with them. I mean, I could grab this fish over here, but it's very close, so it's not gonna be nice to, to settle over there. So I'm just gonna try my luck and go down. It is a marsh, so they can flood, so it's a, bit, a little bit of a risk I'm taking, but I'm willing to take the risk. Um, and I'm gonna get another settler here so that I can 
Oh, that's the timer. I need to hurry up. I need to hurry up. Let's go. Yeah, so we have a timer. I have one more minute, so I'm just gonna quickly pick my research. Sorry, I cannot give a big explanation on it because if I talk too long, it's gonna skip the turn for me and we don't want that at all. There we go. I'll explain a little bit later for people that are new. If you want to know more about the game, just ask in the chat. I'm happy to uh, answer. And my friend here, Surter, is also happy to answer. If he's going to be my friend this game, we never know. You never know with Surter. Uh, so I think we're all set. I'm going to hit that and turn button. Let's see what's happening in the chat. Would you sell the game with Bitcoin? Nah, that's not really... Not really in the in the plans. <laughs> Everyone just recognized Sasuke as Empress End of Game. That would be very boring, wouldn't it? Kida. We do not unnamed. Uh, oh, you already answered my question. As I said, he's happy to answer questions too. Surter has to go. A <laughs> little bit of love for the Surter. I mean, there's some good things there as well. We'll see if he's gonna behave this game. So I see that some people don't have very nice starting positions. Um, yeah, that's always a bit of a, a gamble, I guess. I mean, mine is okay, I think. I'm at this weird edge. Kind of looks like a puzzle piece, I don't know. All right, so they're still walking. There's not much I can do. I mean, I can, I want this population to grow a little bit. It's growing, Should probably go and start off with some farms. I do have a nice rhino and um, I'm always happy when I have rhinos in my starting position because what rhinos do is, I'll hover over this, they give you uh, a an bonus of an income of 60 each turn. So rhinos are very good to get um, and then a fish here which will give me a food bonus of 4. So that's, I mean, I'm, I, I can't complain. So let's go, let's go, they're going that way, they're going that way. Should probably just get a militia. You never know who's coming for you. And I'm gonna build one little teensy tiny farm. Um, yeah. Well, Searcher says, I got your back though I might carry a knife. So yeah, that's basically saying nothing. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. I'm gonna click. Oh, well, maybe I have some time to talk about the technologies I just picked for people that are new to the game. Um, so I chose this one seedling transportation or transplantation. Sorry, I can't hover over it now. That's a shame. Oh, there we go. I can click it. So this one increases farm food production by 5%, which is a nice thing to do in the start of the game to grow your settlements and get more population, which means more money. Um, craft. This one is good because you can clear forests that are in the way. Um, then thought. This one gives a nice early authority bonus. Um, I am planning on expanding pretty rapidly and for that you need authority. And this one, same. Same, same. I'm always going for the early authority. Never really failed me, so... Okay, let's hit and turn because everybody is ready. Hit the gong. <laughs> Mixer doesn't have this game as one of the games you can stream. Oh, well, that depends on what kind of database they're using. I mean, I know that Twitch uses uh, Giant Bomb, um, and we we got it on Giant Bomb. Wasn't very easy, I must say. But hello, Wild Bill TV. How are you? Hello everyone, by the way, everyone I forgot. I'm very sorry. I'm uh, not the best with chat sometimes when I need to do a stream as well. Especially when it's Oriental Empires or a strategy game, you need to pay attention to a lot of things. Um, but yeah, these guys are still taking a little stroll. We have an encounter here, so I would like to grab that one. And let's just hope there's, uh, there's some nice resources or other lovely locations over there that we can grab um yeah these guys are just going that way my militia here just to be safe i could already i mean i could already build a wall just to be extra safe 
I have enough money at the moment, but it will take them some time to build it. That's always a little bit like, do you need it or not? I mean, right now it doesn't look like there's anyone coming for, for me, but you never know. I mean, there's a lot of people on this map, so I'm, I'm gonna play it safe right now. It might not be the smartest thing or maybe too early, bloody blah, blah, but it just makes me feel safe, so I'm just gonna do it. All right, let's press the end turn. We are waiting for Fury Kazan. And Fury Kazan is a really funny player and member of a Discord because he likes to do some role play on the side, which uh, always results in some interesting chat conversations. So let's see if he's gonna do his best this time to shower us with his creativity. fine takes time to get accustomed to multitasking while streaming but more you do it easier it becomes i mean i i stream on my own channel i'm stream creative and it's so much easier to uh talk to the chat while you're doing art but this i don't know with a game it's just way harder um but yeah i guess i guess i need to get used to it all right so we have two encounters that one and that one i'm just gonna try and grab them to see what they can offer me Still not really any interesting resource points here. I'm hoping that I'll find some new ones soon. Um, I'm, I mean, I'm still very, very close to my capital, so I won't mind if they, if they're gonna branch out a little bit more. Um, yeah. They're still building the wall, so I do not want to give them too many tasks. So like right now, 10 people are farming and three are building. I could probably, could probably build another farm like that. Yeah, I'm just gonna take it easy on the peasants. I don't want them to be unhappy at the right at the start. <laughs> all right, this is all good. Let's see how's, how everyone's doing already. Well, there's nothing yet. Oh, only known players? Right. I can't see them yet because I don't know anyone yet. We'll get back to that later. Magion says, I'm so scared because I'm so bad and I'm fairly sure I'm near the Ice Empress. Oh, talking about ice. What was my capital last time? I would say... What would be a nice name? And I'm gonna ask you guys. What would be a nice name for the capital of an ice queen? It needs to be extra special. I'll leave it for now, but maybe you guys have some good suggestions for this settlement. And yeah. Frozen? Really guys, that's the best you can do. <laughs> I was thinking of something really epic, like the domain of the ice queen. Um, yeah, but I'm not. I'm not an evil queen. I mean, ice queen never sounds very positive, but <laughs> it's not that bad. Let it go, city. Oh, very good, Kida. Very good. <laughs> All right. We got the first encounter. Let's see what it is. It is... My lord, I know of a place near here where there is a herd of rhinoceros. Yes, that makes me happy. I am looking for better resources. Their hides will fetch a good price, so I hope you can pay a small reward for my information. Ah, oh, 69. Yes, that's nothing. Let's go to rhinos. Oh yeah, this is what I was hoping for. Oh, that makes me very happy. This is great. Okay, let's just go over there. Ooh, if somebody catches that before me I'm gonna be really pissed off um, still nothing great on this side I'm just gonna continue I'm not I don't really have them guarded I guess this guy should just follow them it's like a rookie mistake never keep your settlers unattended there we go frozen throne I like that one I mean yeah it's from Warcraft but that's yes I'm gonna go for that you just needed a little extra extra to make me do the frozen thing. Thank you, unnamed. I 
Oh, these guys just keep on walking. Oh, that's it then. They're still building. Population is growing. I'm happy. Let's click that and turn button. Waiting for Nevosi. Kita Jon Snow is without the H that you know. Okay, so... So a lot of encounters here, I must say. It would be nice if this is an edge. Maybe I am... Okay, so the map is definitely expanding this way. So I must be at this little area where they connect because that's what america's map maps are you know they're shaped like a big chunk with a little pathway between it and then another big chunk i'd say i am right next to the passage so can be nice can also be very troubling i'd say i should go a little bit more like up and to the left so i have my safe positions i'm just gonna expand more that way I really need to find a better place soon, otherwise I'm just gonna settle there. Because, you know, it's tricky. This guy's here. Come on. Oh, we're grabbing that wall game as well. I really need to protect that area. That is one lovely area. I'm just gonna send another. I got stuff robbed for me before. It won't happen again. Good. Okay. They're still working on their lonely wall. Um, just, gonna, just a few more farms. Why not? Science is still good. All right. Let's press that end turn button. Everyone is ready, I think. Yeah. There we go. No one's fighting yet, so that's good. Yes, resources, great. Okay, so the next settlement's gonna be over there. There we go. I wonder if I will grab the wild game, but it's gonna be hard to grab the horses if I go. If I. Mm. Oh, did we drop someone? Uh oh. Okay, and then we need to rehost Nevosi. Okay, I'm gonna save this game. We're gonna. This happens sometimes, guys. It doesn't happen often, but it happens sometimes. So I'm just gonna save this game. And we're gonna reload uh, this game. There we go. It happens sometimes. Um, let's go. We're just gonna reload it again. Sorry about that. All right, and now we wait. If there are any questions in the chat, just let us know. We're happy to answer them. Oh, everybody is joining so fast. So does the majority of the gameplay play like Civ and the combat a little different or still similar to Civ? Um, I recently just started playing Civ um, definitely the gameplay is very similar to Civ, so if you like Civ, uh, you will probably like Oriental Empires. I mean, Oriental Empires is my first 4X game I started playing, um, and then I tried out Civ and I really liked it as well. So, I'd say the combat is... I'm not sure if I can answer this question. I guess it's kind of similar because you... A lot of people ask if the combat is similar to Total War. Um, and in Total War you can control the battle from beginning to end. Uh, here in Oriental Empires you can give your troops orders. But when the turn ends, everything just starts and you cannot do anything about what happens in the battles when it's happening. Um, and I think Civ has that as well. Although... 
Yeah, kind of. Well, it's different from Civ because then you just give them an order and they do like one or two hacks or slashes or whatever and then it stops. So it's a little bit different, I guess. But definitely not like Total War. I think everyone's here. Do we have everyone? All right, let's go. Still waiting for some people. Alright, here we are. Okay, let me think, what were we doing? We were... Oh yeah, I was about to settle here and I'm just checking. I, I would like to settle and get both of these resources, but I think I'm not gonna be able to grab them both. Also, these hills over here are not great. I mean, they can be farmed, but a lot later. So I'm just gonna take one step there. Then I think if I settle over here, I'll get the wild game. But then again, there's a... Is that a river? Is that a river? That is a river. That one is good for trade. And then if I expand, I'll grab this horse and trade. Although, if I... Oh, this is such a dilemma. If I would go here, I'd grab the river, and I would be able to trade these horses. Yeah. So I'm gonna grab a wild game here as well. I think I'm gonna go for the trade thing. Probably that's... A wise thing to do. I'm gonna go over there. This guy is gonna join him over here to kill anyone that stands in my way. Um, these guys are almost at this amazing spot. This lovely spot. God, if anyone grabs that before me, I'm gonna... You'll see smoke coming out of my ears. Stack without orders. Yeah, he's waiting for the other guy. That's fine. Let's go. Yeah, look. So the bar... <laughs> the bar's not long enough, so you need to scroll. It would be nice, though, if that could be implemented to make it a little bit longer. But yeah, you can scroll. That's a... I don't think we've ever had such a big game. If I recall correctly. Yes, this place is great. Oh, come on, settler. You had to walk one more tile. <gasps> There's no room. No, 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 no. Zavoni, don't do this. <laughs> don't you do this. Okay, let's go in there. Why am I whispering? I'll <laughs> oh, just... Samvona, don't do anything you regret. You're my friend. You've always been my friend. We were such good friends last time, no? Alright. This one's all set. Let's go. Yeah, so we are grabbing this resource now. You can see it because it has a yellow line circling your yellow border. Um, which means we are exploiting the horses. Which doesn't sound very good, but you know what I mean. Um... Trade them. Trade the horses. Just gonna put this guy over there. I think I'm gonna send a little bit more troops down because I don't like the way. I'm just. Wait, when is this wall gonna be finished? Two more turns. I don't think in. Well, I can wait two more turns, I guess. I just sent this guy over here already. Better not grab my amazing settlement position. This guy over there. This guy, okay. Don't fuck me over. Um. 
Alright, so that's all going fine. We have this one. Another city. Is there an ice horse? It's, it's gonna be a... We're gonna give this one a name that stands for the, the horses that we have. Another thought development. Okay, I'm gonna go for the moon because then we can get this one that gives me two authority, which is nice. There we go. Gao Tang, yeah. That one needs a different name. Snowy Stallion, yeah, I like that one. Maybe just Snow Stallion, that's good. Otherwise it just sounds like a Disney, like a Disney attraction. Life is tough, I will die of rebels. <gasps> really? Are you dying of rebels? He's just happily waving. I'm not sure if that's a good or bad thing. <laughs> it's, uh, okay, well, end turn. Woo! <clears throat> oh, shit. Slipe near Odin's horse. Ah. Sorry, I already did it. But that's a very lovely name as well. Captain Picard. Frostmourn for Combat City. That's from World of Warcraft, right? Or Warcraft, maybe just Warcraft. New power, shoo! <gasps> oh, it's not. Oh, they wanted to settle there as well. Don't you all my rhinos, you guys? No, it's mine. <laughs> yes, it's mine now. I'm sorry. It is mine. Okay. <laughs> okay, this guy needs to. I'm just gonna. I don't care how long it takes to build this wall. Like this thing. I feel like this is gonna be my combat city because everybody wants it. Um, yeah, I think that is true. You guys just build a nice farm. You just build the wall. I don't mind any other thing that happens, but you guys build a wall. I think people are gonna s try to steal that stuff. They're not allowed to. There you go. My leader. Either in there. And then just asking, what about drilling the troops so that the troops can have a better moral or buff before losing a majority of troops in the battles? I'm gonna ask Sir's help for this question, but one thing I know is that you have a few. Um, this is one of the things that I'm not very uh, good at yet, but you can see here they have strength and efficiency in their health. Um, so they have a readiness you need to take good care of your troops do not let them walk long distances and then expect them to fight like a, like a champion um there are a lot of a, a lot of other aspects that can make your troops happy like authority um key and ren and then yeah drill troops i guess that's what you mean with like special troops professional troops we'll probably get into that later i think Oh, you died of rebels. What? Okay. I think we're we're good here now. I hope. Yeah. Oh, tech. I'd say we go for this one. And Boyer. Boyer is always good. So we can shoot everyone that tries to get our rhinos. Oh my god, why did... <laughs> Who is that person? Is that... One Sun Mirror, what the hell are you doing? I guess he just settled there. Because one, you might want to be friends with me, or two, you might not want to be friends with me. War between Dogrong and the Shu. They're very close to each other, so that's another moon sugar dilemma. I'm in the middle of two wars, no? What is Han doing here? That is Baka. Baka, you better be my friend. You have something to make up. Because you you ditched me last game, so you better 
be nice this time. Han. Well, you know what? I'm gonna... I'm just gonna... Oh, why not? Well, if I ever can, I'm gonna try and forge that friendship. These guys are still going there. These are going there. I feel like I should build more walls just to be safe, but this population is not that big. I still feel like... Yeah, they still need to be... Uh... Oh, hello, Waka. Hello. It's because I'm in a good mood today, okay? <laughs> this is gonna be Rhino Town, so that's gonna be... What is something with an R? That can be something snowy or icy or frozen. So it, it's nice with... It goes with Rhino. The blah 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 rhino. We have snowy, snow stallion, frozen throne, which is a different one, but still, that's like the capital, so it's special. And then we have the rhino. What do I say to Waka though? There we go. Okay, okay, enter, enter. White Rhino. Hmm. Do I go for this or do I go for that? I'd say the Spearman could be useful. I feel a little bit threatened by the stuff that's happening over here. Um. I want to be friends with Waka. The intensity already epic. Yes, yeah, very intense. White rhino, boreal rhino. Is there something with an R though? I want something with an R. So dog wrong and oh that is Sanvone. I think he always plays a dog wrong. What is happening? Just want to announce the world to the world the peaceful intention of woo. Pepper Rhino, come on, no. An offer. <gasps> yes. I'm gonna accept that one. I feel like Shu is gonna be a little bit of a pain. Raisin, Raisin Rhino, what does that mean? Never heard of that one. Never heard of that word. Rhyme. How far are they with the wall? Two turns. Oh, that's cool. I'll just leave them to it. <laughs> um, okay. are fine they have a wall thinking about oh they're finally growing i'm just gonna leave them alone for a little bit okay Will you Ellie me? <laughs> oh god, what's happening? Ah. Uh. 
I find it hard to say that I'm going to be someone's ally when I don't even know where they are. Maybe you are already kind of scheming to attack one of my friends. The chat is so intense, guys. I'm not going to be a problem, just stay out of my way or be your friend. Yeah, that's how everybody plays, guys. That's that's like saying nothing. <laughs> everybody wants rhinos, everybody wants certain things, and if somebody's in their way, you're gonna attack them. That's just the way you play. I think he's just being friendly because he's not doing very well with bandits, but I'm not sure. We are waiting for King of Manners. Come on, man. It's interesting because I haven't had any bandits yet, so I don't know where they are. Oh, fighting the kin. Chin, I mean. Oh, and then... Sanvon is already working his magic, I see. Settlement. It's like the king of settlements. Okay. So now this is not Shu, but Dokrong. Interesting. Review capital location. I'll only do that when we are going to be nice to each other. How about that? So I, I'm not just gonna reveal my capital out of nowhere. Like, I need to know if you have good intentions or not. I don't like... I don't like weird promises like that. Albino Rhino! I like that one. There we go. Okay. Snow Silent is still growing. I don't want to do too much with them because they are... Uh, there's also just no room. It's a bit of a bad position, I guess. Albino Rhino. I need that wall. Let's go. Frozen throne. Yeah, let's build some more farms here. Anything else we could use? Not yet, I'd say. I mean, I I would like to get a bowyer, but I want to buy that. Uh, I want to buy that or build that here. So I'm just gonna wait until that wall is finished. Um, maybe we can already get some. No, not yet. I want some more militia though. I'm just gonna send these guys out. I'm very paranoid about this place. <laughs> um, maybe I can send my leader off to do some more exploring this way. That might be smart. Maybe this way. Do you explore the lands of your friend or your enemy? Or your maybe enemy, you don't know. I'll just stick with this. I like it that it's snowing now as well because it makes it look like it's supposed to look. Can we already see something like this? Ooh. Hey Faith, how are you? <laughs> Welcome to the icework office. The turns are taking a bit longer now than in the beginning because now stuff is happening. I think people are getting the lay of the land. They are trying to figure out what to do. Um, yeah. You can always kind of see that people need a bit more time to think about their actions now. Ooh, there's a lot of battles happening, so... Ooh, that went fast as well. So, 
Jin and Wu are fighting. I have no idea where they are, so I... Well... Who is attacking him? Is that an AI? Oh, it's AI, I think. Finally saw you on screen. I'm okay. It's right from work. Finally, how are you? Oh, good to, good to hear. Do you have a weekend now as well? I'm doing pretty good. It's always lovely to play some Oriental Empires. The shoot took it back? Oh. There's big conflict happening next to me. I'm not even gonna bother interfering. Uh, just stay away, guys. <laughs> I'd say the future is not to the left, but to the right. For now, I think I'll go that way. These guys. I think I'm gonna make them explore a little bit, but I wanna explore that. Yeah, you guys just explore, it's fine. In three once they're both weakened. That's one of the classics, no? <laughs> No, it's not, it's not, uh, you know, I'm not invading, I am just uniting. So, Snow Stallion still growing. You guys just do your thing. One more turn until my wall is there and then I can breathe. <laughs> I can breathe again. So, if I would, if I were to build a bazaar here, it's too isolated to trade. Hmm. So a bazaar would probably not be useful here unless I build a settlement somewhere in the middle. That kind of sucks. I was very happy with that location. Well. We'll see what happens. So, Magayon and Waka are still thinking hard what to do. Also thinking what my next step is going to be. I'm not sure what these guys want to do. I'd like to get another settlement to be honest. I don't like it that the shoe is just meddling here. It's kind of annoying. I mean there we've got Dog wrong, settling like crazy, like always. We have an offer. Dog wrong, fraternal harmony pact, and okay, so we're friendly with the dog wrong now, which means we have two allies now. We have an alliance with the Han, with Waka, and dog wrong, the Sunbone, and we have Shu in the middle. That's just being a little bit of a pain in the ass settling so close to me. Because we could easily take it and just destroy it because it's in the way. Uh, I hate it when people settle next to you. I hate that so much. It's just a big middle finger in your face. Um, at least we have our wall now. So what we could do is build a bowyer. Because that's nice to have. Um, maybe I don't need it. No, I don't need it yet. I don't want to do that. I can still cancel it. So. Other activities. What does that even mean? They're doing activities. Okay, guys. Cool. You guys do your activities. 
I'm a little bit annoyed with this settlement though. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do about it. I'm gonna think about it for a little bit. So this one proved a little bit useless, I'm afraid. Early rushes are fun, he says. Yeah, would you say protected by a river? Because I can definitely cross the river if I want to. Here's this one guy. I could say we cross here. Or there. Or there. Take my leader. Alright. Shu and Dogrong are still fighting. Wu and Chin are still fighting. Early rushers, I think. I'm gonna see if I can get another settler to get another settlement because it's getting a very, very crowded over here. Which is not great. New air, good. So we can get these encounters over here. That's great. something interesting over here. Let's see if we can get another settler. No, not yet. Two turns, okay. Don't think all the other places have one for me. Nah. It's pretty useless for now. Nah. So we have another technology one. Let's see what we can do now. I would like to get this one, but in order to get this one, you need that one. We can just do that. So I'm not really sure what to do with this this one. I mean, there's nothing I can can't really construct. Well, I could chop down these things and see if I can get another farm going. But apparently, this was not a very nice place to settle because I really can't do anything with it. But sea trade later on could be useful when um, I can trade all those horses, I guess. I don't think Shu is going to like this, but he's in the way. <gasps> oh, the dog wrong is planning to take it, I guess. God, Samvon is really going for it, I guess. You can see. Oh, you can see their uh, plans. Oh, let's go for it. I'm gonna give them the command to charge. That's it, okay. Um, this is still protected. I 
would love another settler. Probably another guy to scout. I'm gonna let that leader scout for a bit. Maybe get another guy to just walk around as well. I really hope that when we cut down these forests that I can get some more farms because I'm not sure what's wrong with this weird place. Frozen Throne still farming. Let's see if we just farm a little bit more. Alright. So, knowing Sandpone, he's probably gonna try and expand really fast and get as much settlements because that's what he always does. Who are with three factions he has? Well, we're not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing. So I think one thing with Americas is often that everybody's very close to each other and I don't know. I've played some America's maps, um, just on my own, and every single time it just felt very crowded, which is not something I enjoy too much because I like to have a little bit of space to get my stuff going. And right now I have two settlements, and two of them are good, and then the other one is somewhere above, and I can't build any farms apparently and I also can't trade because it's too far it's yeah and I'm not quite sure why I can't build farms there because it says grassland and it should be fine maybe maybe it's not all right there we go this battle is happening who got it Crescents are not always fertile. Oh, I'd say it would be. <laughs> okay, so this settlement just... I think he just packed it up and went somewhere else. Okay. Well, don't go into my lens, crazy, crazy mirror man. What's this offer? Attack dog wrong and then they'll become my vassal if I attack the dog wrong. What do I do with a vassal that is... Well, almost useless at this moment. I mean, I'm not gonna attack Dog Wrong, that would be suicide at the moment. Y you can still become my vassal. Oh, I can't. Well, I'd say I can give him truce for 20 turns. Uh, and we'll see what happens. I don't think he has a capital anymore, no? Well, I wanna know his capital. I'm not gonna attack the dog wrong. This guy should just explore. Yeah, he's exploring. I want this guy to just go and auto explore as well. Then I have my leader here who's gonna check out these encounters and. I think by now we should be able to get another settler to get another spot somewhere because we need more settlements to get that money going. We don't really know where to settle. I don't want to settle too close to other places, but right now it almost feels like I have no other choice. Oh god, that alarm thing. Where do we send the settler? Somewhere in the middle maybe here? I just don't like it when it's all cramped together. Maybe somewhere over there. Oh, there's a river there. 
Maybe in the middle, yeah. But there's marshes there, but we can drain the marshes. I kind of would like to go over here, but I don't know what's there. Well, if we walk over here, we can always go that way if we really want to. Ask them to become your vase instead and put flowers in them. Oh, what's happening here? Yeah, so they're in my border. Not sure what he wants. Okay, okay. Taking too long. So, I'd rather not attack him because I've always been good friends with Sunvon. Um, but I don't enjoy him just running around here. Um, I kind of just want to expand to the right, but that's also where my friend is. And judging by what he's telling me, it's probably very crowded over there as well. So I'd say it's very important in the beginning to grab as much land as you can. Knowing Sandbone, he just settles very close to every... I don't really know why he does that. I mean, yeah, you can make a lot of money, but it's going to really destroy your expansion later on. could go and just attack him there I think it would be nice to okay this population is growing we're building some farms I'd say getting a boyer here would be useful by now um, well there are the bandits I think I'm just gonna start with that one I cannot recruit anyone here but I can albino rhino probably recruit some there but I want to recruit something here I'm gonna kill those bandits yeah I think they're with two of those I think if my leader goes and I go with this noble I can get them I think that's it for now. Just tech. So this is an interesting one. Should I go for this one? Probably this one. The well field system is pretty good for um, some extra money. to worry about me I'm just a peaceful trader and explorer I love how everybody's just explaining themselves <laughs> don't worry about me I'm not doing do anything look at that chat going crazy right now Alright guys, so what do you think should happen? I'd say Dokrong over here is expanding fast but also at war. I don't know what's in the middle here. I kinda wanna know what's in the in the middle over there. Alright, let's go. Let's see what's happening. They're gonna go, they're gonna go. Clogs really? Name the city clogs. Hmm. 
another offer. Shu accepts the peace and they reveal their capital location. Okay, so they are over there. Here in the middle is a nice spot. I'd say it would be interesting to settle somewhere over here. Or here. Yeah, get close to the river. These guys have a noble going over there. I'm just gonna send them. Uh, I'm gonna send this guy down. I'm gonna send these guys up. Grab the encounter on the way and make sure the shoe doesn't do anything stupid. Albino rhino over here. It's building the bowyer. Gonna get. Um, yeah, gonna get some more farms happening. Frozen throne. Still going steady, I guess. Still building farms. I'm not too worried about that. This one I'm worried about. I'm not sure with this grassland. I can't do anything with it. I can well, I can build this farm now. But after I cut down these trees, I think there's not going to be much left. Which is a shame. I hope there's going to be a way for me to get that land and make it fertile. In the meantime, they're just going to cut down the trees. And after that, probably just protect it for a bit. This guy needs to go and get the encounter. They, oh, I think they were the guys. Yeah, they are out exploring. Okay. It's pretty rough. I think a lot of people are kind of dying. <laughs> I think America's is a very rough, rough map. So let's see, Hun's doing very well, then Dog Rong, Sanvon, and then me. So he's still doing better than me, I'd say. I'm not planning on grabbing anyone by the throat at the moment. You know, when a player is in a really tight spot at the beginning, I'm not that kind of person that would attack them, I think. I think I'm too nice. <laughs> I just wanted to have a good game as well, but. Knowing Sunbone, he probably has the skill to to get back on his feet again. I hope. <laughs> you guys see this? It's uh... happening. Oh. Dogron has another. Oh yeah, they have more enemies now. Ooh, there's gold here that I would like to have. My man and I have won much renowned for our actions on the battlefield. Oh! Yes. Great. Then we can grab those bandits. Well, these guys are gonna... So we got warrior retinues. Um, this guy's going up there. I'd say... Don't need them. Let's see if I can go... Okay, I want to know what's here. I really want to know what's happening over there. So there is a... Uh, this is water. So this is the tiny little pathway. And this is all... <gasps> oh, it's water. Jeez, I didn't even know that. So... Or is this fog of war? I'm confused now. <laughs> it looks like both. This looks like water, no? Okay, well, whatever. Whatever it is.
So, if I would settle, I'd say I would like to get this gold over here, so I would go over here. Yeah, let's just go there. Where's that noble guy here? Go over there. These guys are gonna fight him, they are gonna grab the encounter. Um, just check the cities. Ah, oh, they're all fine. Do you have some technology? Nope. I guess Samvon is already more than dead. He just wants to give the settlement to me. Oh my god. That is some crazy stuff. Fighting the Yan and the Shu now. And probably Shang. No, this is Shang. Was he fighting the Shang? I'm not sure. I think Shu and Shang, you look, these, these two mask things that they have, they look quite similar. Oh, we're gliding over the map. I'm not even doing anything. We have a little desync. Okay, there we go. We've got another encounter. Witch. Personal authority for 19 gold. Oh, yes. No problem. What would be up here? Let's just get. Maybe there's a nice something over there. It's probably very small, but it could be useful. Come on, get those bandits. It's taken way too long. So, I'm gonna try and grab this location to grab that gold. Albino Rhino is still working hard on that farm, uh, on the boyer, I mean. Let's say we can build some more farms too, just to grow more. Snow Stallion is still chopping down trees and building a farm. I'm not really sure what, you know, the whole not fertile ground thing is kind of <laughs> painful, but they're slowly developing and hopefully somewhere later we can make something out of it. Don't have the well field system yet. Let's see what's happening now. Dogrong is still quite high in the victory points. Then Han. Then. Apparently, then Shu and then me. How am I doing? I'm not sure how I'm doing, actually. Just somewhere in the middle. It's not going very fast. But I guess it's all sable. I feel like we're gonna lose a lot of people in the first round, which is crazy. Don't think we ever had that. Not this quickly. I'd say it's a map, it's America's. She's a throwing threat to the civilized world. I'm trying not to be. You might be right. He's still waving. <laughs> Is that a good or bad wave? He doesn't know. <laughs> yeah, so look, Cabbage Head, I'm just expanding for land, won't wipe out a player yet. But then, you know, that's how I do it. I don't want to wipe out people at the start, but I guess that's the way you win. America suck. Okay. Oh, this is actually my first time. Well, no, second time playing in America's map. Oh, no. We're finding the bandits. Let's zoom in. Boys, come on, boys! <laughs> oh, mine look dangerous. Come on, grab those bandits. I like the way you can really zoom in. 
in, in the current. Why would you stand like that? It's a strange battle. Let's speed it up. Whoa! Ah! Uh, are they dead yet? I'd say we definitely weakened them a lot. Army destroyed. <gasps> was that my new army? Oh, that was the other army. Okay, that's fine, I guess. Just gonna chase them. We have a settler in Albino Rhino. Well, that is good news because I would love another settlement. So these guys are pretty slow. I'd say I would send these guys over there. And then these... I mean, what I could do is just get one here in the middle. Uh-oh. We have someone who dropped. One sun mirror dropped from the game. Um, let's see. I'm just checking the Discord. I think one sun mirror drop dropped. I think we need to reload. Alright guys, we're gonna reload again. We have another player that dropped, unfortunately. Just gonna load up the game real quick. Oh, wait, no, that's not the right one. It's not a drop, it's a tactical disconnect. It's no problem, reloading goes very fast. There you go, come on guys. There they are. We have everyone. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven. Yeah, we're all there. Let's go. We're at the start of this game again. for who are we waiting for all right she first wanted to join oh I had no idea nobody told me sorry um Serger just returned from grabbing a, a glass of water because it's getting hot getting stressed out sweating <laughs> okay
So he's in trouble, the dog wrong. I'd say, well, I wanna <laughs> kind of wanna get my settler over there first and then, well, they're still walking. I guess I could help out. Who's on your back though? Shang? I would not like to have <sighs> Shang on my back, but this is getting very chaotic. <laughs> All right, so this army was destroyed by fighting the bandits. I'm just gonna... Well, if the bandits are still just doing their thing... This leader is just gonna walk. I'd say I'm gonna send these troops. This guy is not too dangerous, but I don't want him roaming around, so I'm still gonna... I'm still gonna attack him. If you're gonna... You know, if you underestimate bandits, they're gonna grab you. Yeah. Just gonna check out what's happening at Clogs here. Gotcha, gotcha. This one I want. We're waiting for Magayon. Magayon. How do you even say that? There we go. Bandits, bandits. Everybody has bandits issues. Come on, get them. That is what Chung is. <laughs> he has this big army. That is cool. Okay. Oh, he he got. Did you just destroy the city, Shang? You say it maga ion, but not actually space out. That does not explain anything. <laughs> I have no idea still. Magayan. Magayan? Magayan. <sighs> Too complicated. Um, yeah, come on guys, walk faster. I don't want to get into a fight with my own intern, it's way too terrible. You're just chilling here, that's fine. Settler, yeah, so this settler is going over there and that one's going over there. I'd say it might be smart for me to settle. There's gonna be a settlement over here, then I might have one over there. It's quite, it's, yeah, it's a bit close to the others, but maybe I should settle here in the middle. He just walked all the way over there, that poor guy. Um, I might want to take that one. Just put it in the middle here so I can do some trading. I mean, it's, yeah, it's not the best location, but... Maybe, you know, something interesting will pop up here, but right now I just... I just kind of want to connect these two. And there's quite some land in the middle. 
Um, yeah. Let's quickly check out. So snow stallion is finally growing, which is good. Still chopping trees. Do we already have the well? No, not yet. The well fields thingy. I'm very curious what's going to happen here. All right, let's go. Technology. Hmm. Uh oh. Well, now the game just picked something for me, so let's hope it's a good thing. Who is finding bandits and the chin? Who's leading? Who's leading? Person leading is Shang. After that, Yan, and then me. And we have discovered the Yan. Is this Yan? Is that Han or Yan? What? Where did I discover them then? Is it this one? This one? This must be Han. Huh? Interesting. We have our guys for Bowyer, so that's good. Let's take them a bit there. I don't know what these guys want to do. They're just standing. Oh, the Yan just walked in here. Better just go back. You never know what they want. Frozen throne. I'd say let's get some more. Just a little bit more protection there. have the boyers here so Yan is over there hmm I just thought I'm not in the mood to attack people but I guess I have to or something what is he doing just chilling there. And there he has some people. I want to know what's what's in the south. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just gonna walk down there for a little bit. Over there. So apparently settling in grassland is bad. I didn't know that. That's why snow stallion is so useless. I just look at resources all the time. But that's a good thing for next time. No settling in the grasslands. And that's, I thought, you know, grassland sounds nice and fertile and I think, oh, grassland, that's a great place for a farm, but apparently no. Only herders can use the grassland. So, the more you know, the more you learn. 
Oh, we have discovered Zhao. Zhao. They have been pillaging the one lovely farm we already had. Yon, what the hell are you doing? That's cabbage. Well, that sucks. I will not stand for that. Snow Stalin is now half dying because of this. <sighs> we have an elephant in the next room, also known as our CEO. Yeah, Jan, this is a shitty thing you do to do. That's not gonna be... We're not gonna be allies when you're like this. <laughs> um, I'd say I would like to settle over there. He puts his nose in everything. No, he was... I don't know if you guys could hear that, but he was like stomping the ground and everything started shaking a little bit for some weird reason every time we're streaming he's doing something noisy so sorry chi but the need for gold is real he says well just prepare now now i'm angry <laughs> um I'm just gonna say you suck because you suck cabbage you suck zone. Ah, I don't think it's your zone, sir. I'm too slow. I will tell our CEO what you called him. How you do? I guess he already knows. <laughs> So Shang over here thinks he's uh, the big boy now, which is fun. I don't think he is though. Hmm. Do you have any boyers? No, no boyers. I mean archers, not boyers. We're gonna send some reinforcements. And then Jan here is being a bit of a so, I'm just gonna kill that guy. Go away. I don't know what he's doing over there. Oh man, everybody's up in my... Shh. at all. Alright, it's time to recruit a lot of stuff because people are being idiots. Let's 
so yeah, whatever. There we have the first message from Furi Kazan, which is always a work of art. <gasps> From long, a long time ago, my ancestor told me about the region of never-ending winter. It fills my heart with delight to lay my mortal eyes upon this paradise where the frost plum is shining like the new moon. Just get a heart. That is beautiful. Okay, okay, okay. What did the AI... Ooh. Horses we love, horses we need, horses. So, albino rhino, good stuff, good stuff. Got more farms. Frozen throne here. It's just building farms, but that's good. Better not, well, I'd like to build a farm, but then it's just gonna, it's just gonna destroy it anyway. Okay, okay. There you go. Oh, we're finding the shun now. Great, that's fun. I see now, I see. We're gonna unleash full force on Shang now. So this is gonna be fun. Where's Waka? War between me and oh, so disappointing. <laughs> Did you just settle next? Furry needs to go, okay. Well, thanks for playing, Furry. See you next time. Um, okay, Sean, yeah, you're doing this bullshit. I'm gonna bullshit you back. Jan has gone, which is good. He's just looting my farm just because he needs gold, and now my, my people are dying, so I don't know. You wanna be proud of that? You shouldn't. Just build this wall now. Chibei should start building a wall too. Roses are red, violets are blue, the Shang have declared war on you. Beautiful. <laughs> Dogrong's going to help me. Oh, that's good. Hey, I already said. Okay, this one. Power. I'm gonna go for irrigated farmlands. I'm not sure. Barracks. Nah, I'm gonna go for the mm, barracks. Would be good. We have those well field systems. Good, let's go. Oh, 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 I got my settler here. 
I think the plan was to oh, go over there or go over here. No, go over. I'm gonna get some more better lamp. This is very close, not this one. This one is better. Whew, right in time. He's, uh, he's finding me there. He's still alive? Player dropped. Oh, Fury. Okay, he was leaving, so that's cool. Oh, he took you by. Okay. Doesn't matter, though. guys here uh, won't be able to Click it anymore? Wait. No. I don't trust this guy as well. Not sure what he's gonna do. I need to get my leader out here as well. Let's go to Sanitaire. This is only good for trade, so I'm not going to do that. All right. Um. Jan is still hanging around here trying to get my farms. I guess that needs to be eliminated. You better not go over there. Not this guy, I need him over there. Checking that one unit of mine. I guess it's keeping them busy. An offer, let's see. So, is that an AI? Or is that a real person? It's an AI. Sure. Would like to see more land. All right, Han, that's fine too. Zhao and Shang are fighting. I'll be friends with anyone who kills Shang. Maybe I can just pillage some of his farms. Oh, he destroyed it, that's funny. Then we'll go and visit him.
don't want another war, but if he starts pillaging my lands again and again, it won't be pretty. I'll give you... I'll give you the, uh, you know... For now, I'll be nice, but... Don't start doing that again. Frozen Throne can get an upgrade. We love upgrades. Let's go. City upgrade. That's always a good thing. Snow Stallion is finally kind of coming back up to speed. If I find and destroy them, it would have to be because of my. Because of me, my vessel as payment. Oh. still building their wall. This should be a big military kind of city. So I can squash him. Every time it's my timer. Okay. Offer by Zhao, a fraternal harmony pack. Yeah, okay, that's cool. All good. Ally request by Han. Declare war to Zhao. Oh, why did you declare war though? Why did you declare war on Zhao? I need them to be friendly. <laughs> I don't want war with you, god. That sucks. We have another settler somewhere. No. Of course not. Careful though with this one. People are just threatening each other in the chat. <laughs> okay. Um, what a noble guy. Upgrade it. So we're gonna make us a lot more money. Maybe this one, that's a safe spot. Snow Stallion is finally getting somewhere. Albino Rhino is growing. And then this guy, yeah. They should just build their wall quickly.
he sat up next to me. I think he now he's just trying to. Uh, I think now he's just trying to get into a fight. <laughs> Sunphone, why, why? Can't accept that. Here with his little units again. I'm just gonna let them walk over there. They're going over there. I think I just want to protect my gold over here. Oh, that guy does it. I can't hear you type so loud behind me. He's cooking up those starter plants again. I don't know. And now, of course, Xiao is attacking me. Their banners look a little bit like mine. I mean, it's the same kind of color. Oh, that's my guy just walking around still. Sorry, Samphone, but you should not have settled there. That's not very cool. I could send my troops all over there. Did they finally finish their wall? Nah. That's going to take a long time. Yeah. 
Let me get him over here. Can I get... I can't be friends with Joe. I'm gonna try. Alright, you have my two gold. Jesus. Um... I'm just gonna try. I mean, they're all, all everywhere. Eight minutes remaining. Oh god, the time went really fast. Okay, there we go. Mostly I'm peaceful, but if you're gonna settle right next to my city, that's just... Ugh. for this. build this palace so I can get some more units. Sambone is actually leaving, I think. Because he's like as good as dead. Which is crazy because he's one of the guys that actually wrote a really good guide on Oriental Empires. So this is one of those things where you see that you can be so good at the game, but still, if, if you know, the situation is bad, it doesn't matter how much you know. <laughs> or something. <laughs> Hey, inactive wall. <laughs> Catching another stream? How are you? It's almost ending though. Five more minutes. Samvon, you did really well. I'm proud of you. Awesome. We have Fraternal Harmony Pack with Jan. Oh, okay. 
Okay, that that's what I would like. War between Zhao and Shu and Han and Shu. It's chaos. I guess we don't have to go over there or there anymore. I'm just gonna press on down. No, I don't wanna do that. I would actually like to dispense some units for a little while because <sighs> money's going fast with all these units. You see immediately that we get more money now per turn because we disbanded some units that are expensive. Last turn, guys. I forgot to say. Otherwise, you get that one more turn stuff that they're asking you. <laughs> it's an interesting game. Just get a thumbs up. <laughs> So this is uh, our first game of 2018 and we will um, continue this game next Friday and it's going to be the same time, same amount of hours and we will see what happens. I mean right now we already lost San Von, which is crazy. Dogger wants information, oh well, that's cool. There's peace between Dogrong and Yang, Han and Zhao, and Dogrong and Shu. So yeah, this I'm just gonna save the game right now. It's a very interesting game. We already lost Sunbone, which is crazy. Um, if we look at the stats here, see that Zhao, the AI, is doing very well. Then Chu, then Shang, and then me. Uh, the, you know, Han, Yan, Dokrong, Chu, and of course bandits are last. <laughs> so it's an interesting game. I mean, we're not that far apart from each other. It's crazy how high the victory points already went. Um, yeah, this can get really interesting next week. So um, for everyone that liked the stream, please give us a follow. So you'll know when we're back. I mean, we're definitely back next Friday from uh, 4 to 6. And I think we are in GMT plus one time zone. Um, Serta, would you like to share some thoughts on this game? No, he doesn't want to share any thoughts on the game. Anyways, um, that means we saved the game. We're going to quit and... Uh, we will see you next week. Thank you so much for hanging out and for everyone just starting their day. Good luck. 
for everybody that ends their night today. Have a really nice weekend and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.